Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. this is Coins Kid. I'm just gonna dive into Bitcoin once again. Thank you for support, okay? Big up the Coins Kid crew. Thank you for liking this video, by the way, and thank you for sharing it as well and becoming a subscriber. Amazing, thank you. So right now, Bitcoin has carried out a double M top hand. There was a bit of FUD last night, okay, around uh, Evergrande defaulting, and I think a lot of the markets tanked. You know, we've seen a bit of a correction, but things are starting to pick back up again. Uh, just here, there is a potential right now that if we don't break this level of resistance, okay, we need to get back above these hourly EMAs, okay, these four hourly EMAs. I do apologize. This is the four hour time frame. Get back above that yellow line, which is 20, and that level of resistance just there, and start to take out. And this is your bottom, okay, because you're forming an impulsive wave, and your impulsive wave target from here will be just here, okay. To there to there and that'll be your impulsive wave target at 73130 so from here right now you know that is a lovely little upside on bitcoin of around about 11.8 percent but it needs to break out of this pattern this is potentially some kind of little continuation bear pennant pattern basically where you come down like this start to come up and then you roll again okay coming back down to another level of support you can see you've held support just here this ascending triangle you see it's boom 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 broke out fell back to support beautiful little wick continuation so that's good but if you was to lose this support right now and especially for hourly ema and you roll over i would anticipate you're going to carry out a bit of a bear pennant pattern okay and a bear pennant is a continuation so from there to there wherever you do start to break out you know whether it's towards here or there wherever if you do start to roll and it is a big if you will carry out a bear pennant pattern and your technical support will be all the way down here on this trend line you see that this horizontal that you've broken out of falling back to support bounce continuation and you're putting your big abc correction right there so it's a potential play and this is what i do i'll show you everything on the channel okay so potentially some little bear pennant break back above get back above the channel line on four hour to 20 start to come back up against six six four seven seven break that back test support see you later you're looking at impulsive break here for bitcoin on the one six one eight target up there okay so it's all good it's all good you're moving upstairs we're tracing coming back to key level support see you later for bitcoin so watch this space okay so it's a quick little update for you today uh, i'm a bit all over the place today and i'm going to try and get a few updates um out just relatively quick updates uh worst case scenario as i've shown you multiple times if we do put in a whopping correction here I and mean, something like an a a b and a big c leg down for me just come to the daily and put some cheeky bids on the daily 20 uh, daily 55 ema i do apologize and i do think you'll be fruitful okay because i've looked at the history of bitcoin and uh when in november I'm not saying this will happen. People think because I'm saying it's going, it, it, it's not. It's like a guaranteed thing. Honestly, I've not got a crystal ball. Just there, we're putting a double M top pattern, okay, in in November as well. Putting a double M top pattern just there, and we came back. And where did we find support on the daily 55, okay, around about the 12th of November. I don't know what the date is today, but it's around about the 12th of November. So it's it's pretty similar, isn't it? Okay, so do keep an eye on it. You know, I'm not saying it will happen or won't happen. It's just something that we need to keep an eye on. And you know, for me, that would be a last level of support in this bull market. Would be that daily. Uh, that daily uh, 55 EMA right there, a nice little wick down bounce would offer a fantastic opportunity going forward and it'd sort of be mirroring and repeating what it did in a previous bull run. But just because it's done it before does not necessarily mean it has to do it again. But I'm just making you aware, okay? So that's basically Bitcoin. Take care, everyone. Back soon with another update. Stay healthy, stay strong, stay tuned. Bye-bye.